Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I have something special for you and it's because it's a little bit of a book haul. Kind of like nine months ago, <laughs> I pre-ordered the Air Awakens series from the bookish box and actually a couple of days they arrived, but I was feeling a little bit under the weather and I just, I didn't want to film anything. So I already opened them, I already saw them they're beautiful, but I just wanted to share this with you. So here it is. So they actually came in this box. Well, actually this box was inside another box, um, but they were very well protected. So that's something I appreciate a lot. So here it is. It's unbelievably beautiful. I do remember that it was going to have the whole box um but yeah it's, it's just stunning and this i i cannot that that's just amazing and honestly every single book is just so beautiful that i regret nothing having spent the money on this so i honestly don't know how they make things happen because I have only seen the cover for the first book and nothing else. So I was a little bit hesitant because I just didn't saw anything else. It was a shock when I finally got the box and I could see everything. Uh, sometimes they do um, do a little bit of spoilery things in their Instagram, but I haven't been really much in Instagram lately, so I haven't seen anything. But, well, this is the card. It literally says everything up the box. And the artists that work in this. And just let me tell you, the covers, they're just beautiful. So here it is, the first book. I, I don't know, I mean, I love all of them, but for some reason, I think this is my favorite. So that's the cover. Um, as you saw, this makes the castle at the end and it does have this shine on the back. They have spray gauges. I mean, come on, they're just beautiful. I'll, I'll probably do take another other shots of this, but they're just beautiful. And when you open them, there's also like these end papers are different in each book. Just let me show you the artwork in the back of the dust jacket. I'm very tempted to remove the dust jackets and just frame this because this is just amazing, unbelievable. I just freaking love this. So there's a dust jacket on the first book and now it's time for the naked hardcover. If you saw my reading journal, I did mention that I love gold details and that's why I have them in my journal. And this just screams to my heart. It also have This is very soft. It's probably more like paper than texture. Fabric. And at the end, I also have this amazing detail and every single one of them was signed and and I'm just gonna show you one of the headers just look at this that's just beautiful it also has a map I'm almost sure it has a map but I can find it right now oh yeah it does have contains a map which nice I love a good map and yeah, I cannot wait to read this. I started to read The Awakens probably like nine months ago, but um, I found out about this one. So I just kind of stopped. And now that I actually have my books because I do want to read these copies, I'll probably read the whole thing. <laughs> I'm also subscribed to Elise Kova's newsletters and she kind of has this like, Readathon for the first book, and 
she sends you like an email every few chapters and it's like you have to read along with the emails and I don't know that just seems a fantastic experience and that's exactly what I'm going to do now that I finally have my copies so yeah that this is the first book they're just so soft um like I said I'm very tempted to remove the those jackets but at the same time I just love the castle so so the second book is Fire Falling. Again, stunning cover. I am completely shocked. It does contain the gold details at the end, which love it. Sprayed edges with fire on them. Up and down. The end papers again, just for this book signature there's another map i'm not sure it was the same map oh and i haven't realized um the headers are different too so that's cool and the artwork in the dust jacket i am in love with this and the book itself And there's the back. Also, I didn't realize, but these books are way heavier than I expected. Just a little bit of information there. The third book is Earth's End. Just look at this. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. The back, the sprayed edges. They're a little bit like, they're like mountains and roses. I love roses, so I just, that's like perfect for me. And the end paper, the artwork in the dust jacket. I'm just in love with this. And the book itself. I really like that they don't have the same design. So this is the first thing that I have bought from the bookish box. Um, I did want to get them uh, from Blood and Ash series from them, but I couldn't, they, they were sold out. And now I'm like, I think it was better that. Because of the book itself, I really would want to have them, but I'm very, surprised and I mean not like I expect to be bad but but these books are totally worth the money so this is the fourth book just just look at this cover and the heart the back again I'm in love with this gold details oh and the spray they just um, these are waves and roses. Just beautiful. The end papers. You know, I feel like they went so much farther that they needed to. And I totally appreciate that. Oh, they are work. I understand why this is a little bit of a gray because yeah the first one was blue um i would have liked that the first one it's air weekends would have been more maybe a light gray or a blue sky and this one would have been blue it kind of looks a little bit blue on on camera but trust me it's it's kind of great. Yeah, it's not like a deal breaker for me. I, I haven't realized this. Okay, you have to see this. Did every single book have this? Because I just did not get that. It's crystal crowned. Just look at this. I love illustrated covers. If you don't know, I'm an illustrator myself. So, yeah. A crown. I love this. 
And here we have crystals and roses. I think this is the longest one. No. Look at this artwork. I mean, it's, I'm just crazy for the artwork. I hope, since I haven't read these books, I hope the books are just as beautiful and amazing as these editions. Because, I mean, th this color is just freaking beautiful. Okay, now, oh yeah, they do have, okay, here, I hope, yeah, there's a crystal and the crown. Oh, I didn't show you the, here we have crystals, again, signed, I don't even remember if I show you, maps. I don't know if they're the same maps. I do notice that the pages are very thin, Nothing against it, but that means that the actual book is longer than I thought. I'm in love with these books. I'm so happy that I got them. And now I can totally start reading this. Yeah, I think that it was totally worth the money. They're just amazing editions. And uh, I still don't know what to do about the artwork. I'll show you again the box since it's empty right now. Long live Solaris. Okay, here we have the names of the books. And at the back, it's in partnership with Liskova and Silver Wing Press. Beautiful. The complete series. Now I should probably put them back. Oh, it has a dent. You know, in some of the books, I think the third one, the naked hardcover, the design was a little bit off the center, but I'm not going to complain about that because I understand that sometimes this, these things happen and the book's still beautiful. So. so I love them and that's just fine. So that's probably all for this video. Um, I'll probably read them and tell you my thoughts about them. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know if you have read these books and if they are as beautiful and as magical they seem with this cover. And also, now I need to put these books on my TBR show. You probably don't know because I, I don't think I have mentioned, but this one here is my TBR show and there's no space. So, so probably the next video after this is a bookshelf reorganization and maybe a bookshelf tour. I still don't know how that's going to work, but stay tuned for that. It's very highly going to happen. So yeah, that's everything for this video. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.